Required tools are a 7-8 deep well socket and ratchet, a 1-inch open-ended or adjustable wrench, an automatic center punch, a 3 16 pilot drill bit, a number 4 step drill bit, and an electric drill. Cut out and affix the whole location template as per the instructions provided on the template. This will be located on the very last page of the manual. After attaching the template, use an automatic center punch to mark the locations of the holes on the brew kettle. Locating the holes accurately is critical to the installation of the heater coil. If necessary, use the automatic center punch multiple times to increase the depth of the indention. Make certain the center punch marks are indented deep enough to prevent the drill bit from moving off the mark when you start drilling. Use a 3 16 drill bit at moderate speed to make a pilot hole at each center punch mark. Use the number 4 step drill bit to increase the size of the pilot holes to 5 8 inch. To avoid creating excessive heat during drilling, operate the drill at low speeds. As the size of the hole increases, the required drill speed decreases. You can use the step drill at very low speeds from the inside of the kettle with light pressure to remove the burr. Do not over drill. Lower the boil coil into the kettle at an angle with the terminal pins pointed downward. Guide the terminal pin and bulkhead through the respective holes. After the threaded portion of the bulkhead protrudes through the holes, install the plug protector. While holding the boil coil in place, install one bulkhead retaining nut on each threaded bulkhead finger tight. Use the 7 ace socket and ratchet to tighten the bulkhead retaining nuts while aligning the boil coil from the inside of the kettle with the 1 inch open ended or adjustable wrench. Reinstall the Boilermaker dip tube between the first and second coils of the boil coil. For 20 and 30 gallon boil coils, install the coil spacer opposite the heater bulkheads. For 55 gallons, install the coil spacer approximately 120 degrees away from the heater bulkheads. 